John Stafford is also very, very hard to convert because he has sold his soul to the devil in a form of Freemasonry. He was what he thought was poor. He wants to become rich. That is the quest of Satan right there. And you can see how it's plagued the entire family. But it's plagued his marriage. It's plagued his soul and the souls of his children because all he wants to do is find out what kind of job they have and what kind of money they're making. And he doesn't want to help them very much financially. So, and he definitely doesn't want to open his house up to them in any sort of charitable way. So, we have to wonder why in in a lot of respects this divorce of Betsy is a good thing for him to humble him to have him return to the church in a noble way to have him take care of his daughters instead of pushing them out of the house making them work like men he's got a huge responsibility on his part that he's just not really carrying the cross let's pray for John that he really completely gives up his heart mind body and soul to Jesus Christ that he goes to daily mass and takes those daily uh, daily Eucharist that he goes to weekly confession and he humbles himself he goes back to Knights of Columbus and starts doing good instead of becoming an agent of the devil